Oh my gosh, your makeup looks really good. I love it. Thank you. This week is a huge week. Maddie's up for a People's Choice Award. She's nominated for the Seriously Popular Award. I mean, it's not just a little award. I mean, this is huge. You're against Bella Thorne, who I know you're friends with and you love her. Ruby Rose, who is in orange with this new black. She's beautiful. Never heard of her. Go ahead. Kylie Jenner. Why? And Cara Delevingne. It's OK if I don't win. Because... Well, Maddie, you've always been my choice. Who are you taking to um, People's Choice? I don't know. They gave Abby two tickets so she can bring a date because Mackenzie's not here. She stayed back in Pittsburgh to do a competition with the Pittsburgh studio. Hi. Oh, hey. You're tan. You're brown. She is tan. So what time do you head out? 3.30. I wish I was going. I wish you were going, too. Uh, you know what? I think we all should go to support Maddie. I mean, my god, who gets this opportunity? As exciting as this all is, I have to get moving, because this week is going to be busy, busy. Tonight is a very exciting evening. It's the People's Choice Awards. And our very own Maddie Ziegler has been nominated for a People's Choice Award. I know Melissa gave Abby two tickets. I would love, love, love to go. There's going to be a lot of celebrities there. And there's only one solo this week. And it's going to Maddie. Maddie, you are performing a prestigious routine entitled The People's Choice. Ah, uh, or not. That's what it's called, The People's Choice or not? OK, so you guys go into the other room. I want to like figure out what jewelry and shoes I'm wearing. I'm leaving early tonight to attend People's Choice Awards with Maddie and Melissa. But I still have an extra ticket left. Is Bryn back here somewhere? She's trying on her costume. OK. Hey, Ooh, look at you. So um, I was thinking about taking you to the People's Choice Awards with me. Really? You want to go? Yeah. Yeah. We have to get you together, like, literally in five minutes. Bryn is kind of always on the outs with the kids. You know, they don't include her in things because they can't stand her mother, Ashley. And since I'm considering putting her on the team permanently, I want to see how this kid behaves. Does she have proper theater etiquette? Does she have the right manners? Can I see you? Me? Yeah. Oh. Oh, look how cute you look. I like it. I'm going to take her with me. You are? Yes. Abby, why would you not take your students? She That's wanted to like go. Ridiculous. This one is Maddie's best friend. That's who you I really should take. Saw. All these kids have been to award show after award show. Bryn has never been to an event like that. Does Melissa know Bryn's going with you? Probably not. Melissa's going to die when she sees this. Melissa invited me, and she gave me two tickets. She bought two tickets. She didn't say, this ticket's for somebody else. You and Bryn go have a good time. I just want you to know Melissa will be disappointed. It's it's not worth the aggravation. Oh my god. I can't, this is, I can't take her. I just think it's sad that they can't just for once be like, oh, happy for Bryn no. ever. It's not going to no. happen. Bryn is not going. Do you want to go, Jill? I do want to go. If Bryn is not going, I will go. All right. Now I'm going to get my lipstick. I have an evening bag. I have perfume. I need a little more than an evening bag. <laughs> what kind of person gets excited about taking an opportunity away from a 12-year-old little girl and using it for herself? I mean, the People's Choice Awards? Like, that's a once-in-a-lifetime thing. Jill is a She's not going to go. I mean, are you happy? But I don't understand why Brynn is not going. Because I mean, you guys got so mad. You guys got so upset that then Abby was like, well, maybe yeah, I shouldn't so take her. In that case, I can't yeah, go. Ashley, the that she is, has to try to throw it in my face that I stole Bryn's ticket. I would never tell her not to go. No one wants it. No one wants to go. It's, it's like a bad deal. Bryn did want to go until you guys ruined it for her. That's just, uh -huh, uh -huh, yeah. Who was going? Nobody now. Nobody is going. So, Melissa, tell us about last night. Tell us all about your award. It was just so. I'm like, oh my god, my daughter is just She's a, a star. star. Last night was perfect. I mean, Maddie won the People's Choice Award. 
I was so excited, she was so excited, she was shocked. Matt didn't even think that she had a chance against these huge celebrities, but she won. It was definitely one of the highlights of our entire life. It was so, so cool. Well, you missed a lot here yesterday. Rehearsal was pretty much over. We were sitting here, and the last five minutes, it just turned into, like, World War III. Abby parades Bryn out here, all dressed up, ready to go to the awards. And we're like, why Bryn? That's what we said. Her reasoning was that Bryn had never been anything like that before. That's a dumb reason. Abby uninvited her when you guys threw such a fit. Did we uninvite her, or did Abby uninvite her? Abby uninvited her, invited okay. her because okay. of So you. it's not our fault, it's Abby. Where's the trophy? Right here. Woo! So, Abby, I have a question for you. Did you uninvite Bryn last night? Yes. Why? Because it, it offended everybody so much. I just don't, I just don't understand why you get to dictate what nice thing I do for some kid. I didn't. That's nuts. I was just fed up with it all. I was like, you know what, fed up. this is forget it. You should have just taken Bryn because. I can take whoever I want. That's she my, gave that's her her point. And that is who you chose, so you should have followed through and taken Bryn. Well, what shoulda, coulda, woulda. I should have done a lot of things different, Jill. Maddie, you just won the People's Choice Award. So, we don't have to call it People's Choice or not. Yeah, I was hoping that, because that would be really embarrassing. So, you need to do an amazing job. You were the people's choice. You better be the judge's choice, okay? Show me what you have. Now that Maddie is a household name, everybody is going to be looking at her to make a mistake. They want to pick her apart. That's what critics do, but I'm not going to let that happen. It's my job to make sure that her dancing is perfection. Shoulders down. Hi, girls. Hello, how are you? Congratulations no, 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 last no, no, night. Thank you, like, no. Oh my gosh. Feel heavy it is. Wow. With Maddie winning such a huge honor, prestigious award, she's only gonna go up from here. She just had to turn something down for the team, and you know, it was a pretty amazing opportunity, but it's okay. She's still thinking of her team. Always, always thinking about, she's very mature. All these magazines are talking about Maddie leaving the team, and Melissa refuses to acknowledge it. The team and our girls really need to plan for our future, whether it's with or without Maddie. The people have chosen you as their winner. Another win, yes, and more pressure. The more you win, the more people expect. She is the people's choice. Now, it's even more imperative that she get out on that stage and she be everything that they could imagine. What do you think about the rumors? Because I've been dealing with it 24 seven. Someone asked me on the carpet, they were like, are you still with, you know, your, the ALDC? I was like, of course. I think stopping your dancing would be detrimental. Just be vocal about it. I'm with the team. I'm not stopping to dance. I have to work it out so that I can do both. You can do it. You can do it all, right? So, Maddie, what happens next? Do you stay with the ALDC next season? I mean, obviously, I want to stay dancing. As of right now. Is Maddie leaving the team or not? What is it, Melissa? You've got to make up your mind at one point, because we all need to make plans, especially me and Bryn. Hey, hey. hey there she is. Hey, hey. So, Maddie, come on. Get up here. Let's go. I want children in the audience to go I want to be like Maddie, all right? Abby's putting a lot of pressure on me to win today, and I just want to make Abby, my team, and my fans proud. Next, we have entry number 10.2. It's Maddie with the People's Choice.
I think Maddie will be the judge's choice with this dance. She was amazing. She was flawless, just like always. Your high score, first place, entry number 10.2, the People's Choice. Maddie was exquisite. Take a bow. Great job. And a great ad from my studio.